So, this is my old comic binder. I made a bunch of comics and I did drawings with my old friend. Oh, yeah. So, backstory. In fourth grade, I had made comics with my friend Christian. And we came up with this superhero right here. I don't remember his name. I think it was like Flame Guy or something like that. This is not his original look. This is his bow damage look. Um, our friend, like, one of our other friends actually came up with the idea. But, and we decided to use it. So technically credit to him. But then I think, I feel like we, but then this design here, the bow damage was my idea. So, um, my friend Christian, he was a really good artist. We were both pretty good. I'd say he was the better artist though. Um, he did this drawing for me because when he made this, it was around like December before Christmas break. And he made this to put on my binder that we were going to have for comics. So he drew this. Says Merry Christmas. And he also drew Fox in the back. Now he just. This wasn't based on any Foxy. He just wanted to make like a, a buff Foxy. But I like to see it as like Samurai Foxy. Because it looks like that in my opinion. Because it's really buff. But yeah anyways. um, This was my version of him. The original version was. Like normal. He um. He uh. Oh I just realized he is, he's missing a hand. So that's that's weird. But he's whatever. I think that was an accident, but, um, his original look was, he had a foot, but then in one of the comics, he got hit by an explosion, and he got a robot foot, but this Christmas design was his, I was Christian's idea, and he did this, and, you know, that was pretty cool, I, I wish we made a, a book, I made a comic book of Christmas, I remember we doing it for New Year's, but we never finished it, because the problem, we had two binders, one, I kept half of, and one he kept half of, but I kept half of my stuff, and I kept half of his comics, so, you know, where we could remember each other. And he kept half of his comics, and the other half. Actually, I was in third grade. Can I remember I repeated first grade? And so he was a great ahead of me. So, he was in fourth grade, I was in third. And then when it came to fifth grade, I was in fourth, and he was in fifth. And we that was going to be our last year. So, we decided we were going to do binders and swap them. So, then we could both have half of both of ours. And that was cool. But then, when COVID happened... Spring break, we thought we would see each other in the week. It was like, all right, see you next week, and like, uh, we can finish up the comic. And he's like, sure. And then that's when COVID happened. And at first I was happy, but then I realized I was never going to see my friend again because by the time school would start again, it would be next year, and he would be going to six and be going to a different school because my school in the past was an elementary school. They didn't have sixth grade, so I wasn't going to see him. And either way, his family moved because of COVID, so even if there was a sixth grade, he still would have been gone. And I never got to see him again. So it kind of sucks. But I'm going to show you guys a bunch of stuff we made. I actually was a pretty good designer. I made some comics. Now I know Tigris World is like that whole like animated dude. I was kind of bad at that. But when it came to drawing comics with like actual pencil and all that. I said I had pretty good. Like all of this was me. I remember I made a few books. Also this. Hold on. It was funny something. But we decided... And, like, before COVID happened, me and Christian decided we were going to make, like, our own comic, like, series. Because we made books, comic books separately. But then we decided that why not we make comics together. Like, we sw like we mixed them. Like, we'll, we'll all, we'll all, we both animate in one book. So, like, one page would be me, one page would be him. And so we decided to make our own little title thing. And whenever it would have this in the corner, like, see, like that, it would mean it was something we worked on by ourselves. Like, both together. If it doesn't have this, we worked on it by ourselves. If it has this, we did it together. And this one we did together, apparently, because it has that. So, yeah. Um, I actually never finished this because COVID happened. So, all of this that was in the FNAF 3 was mine. Like, we decided we, the first half was going to be me and the last half was going to be him. But since COVID happened, we never got to finish it. So, this, the whole FNAF 3 is basically just my design. But here's Springtrap. It was FNAF 3, Fast and Fright. I actually, one time, like, uh, maybe last year... I actually decided to, d to draw some more of it. I wanted to continue it, but then it kind of like took a break, and I lost this, but I found it. So we got Phantom Freddy, Springtrap, the Night Guard, Phantom Balloon Boy, Phantom Chica. Um, yeah, this was in the past when I thought Phantom Chica was missing an arm, but it was actually Phantom Foxy. I don't know how I thought that. And then Phantom Puppet. I didn't have Phantom Foxy on here because it was actually like really hard to design, in my opinion. I don't even think he's in this at all. I would like to continue it. If you guys want me to. Um, night 1, 12 a.m. 
Pizza burnt down. What FNAF one? Oh yeah, I I, I kind of suck that spelling. So yeah, what FNAF one? Which is FNAF two? Burnt down. Yeah, I'm not gonna read it because it's a lot. But here I'll show you get so you can pause it if you want. But yeah, the spelling isn't completely accurate because I I wasn't as good during the time. But yeah, if you want to pause it, you can read it. That's why I'm going slowly, so then you have some time to read it if you pause it. So yeah, I was going to film a video side of the Mario thing, but uh, it's very loud out because of construction working. So uh, I'm instead doing this video right now because I actually found this and it's cool. My old childhood before YouTube. And then after a few months, I would start YouTube. So, cool. Um, I do wish I had his number, but I was a kid during the time. Oh, I remember that. That 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 we worked on together. I remember that one. And then there's the part two. I I need to staple this together. So yeah, I think it was like night two or something like that. Or oh wait, I did fit the Foxy. You know, it's actually not bad. That looks like that was Christian design. Because I remember mine, his looked similar to that. So I think that might have been his. And here, I never finished this. But I actually, this is what I continued. After, like, what, I continued this last year, but then I kind of stopped. I wonder how different my designs would look now. This Phantom Cheek. Yeah. If I were to continue this, I would make Phantom Cheek of Still Mr. Arm. Because even though it's inaccurate... I don't want the design to look different from th this, but whatever. So, yeah. Hmm. So, interesting. Um, but, yeah, I need these to go together. And put that there. But this. Oh, man. I might need to make a part two of this, which I'm sure you guys will want. Now, I never... I only colored the front because, I mean, it was a lot and... And I thought sometimes the coloring would make the design look a bit weird. Here's FNAF 2. Yeah, this is the one we worked on together. And I finished this one, I'm pretty sure. So, I know he helped me because this is Christian's design of a character of Phone Guys. So, I know he helped me with this one. Once again, um, I'll go slow so you can pause it and see it. Oh man, memories. I'm remembering what's going to happen. Yeah, I want to make our story a bit different, like a secret, kind of like why phone guy. Yeah, I know he drew this part. Um. Yeah, we tried to make our design look similar when we would do a comic together, so it wouldn't look completely off. What the frick is that? An erase mark? Did I erase that, or is that on the other side? Oh, that's on the other side. Weird. It looks like whatever. It's it's going through that. Put that there. I never stapled this one either. Huh. Yeah, wow. Man, this is like, this was my whole childhood, but now I'm all into YouTube and all that, and I basically wouldn't have time to make one of these. Oh, <laughs> oh wait, that's the exact same thing I did for Phantom Foxy, now this is with the Foxy. Kind of did that. Bro, that's me. I'm looking so confused my eyes, bro. I think that was Christian's design, because that... I don't know. I think he did both. Interesting. And then the... I think this is the last... Yeah, this is the last part. <laughs> bro, it looks so goofy. Oh, oh yeah, I did finish this. Just pop it. <laughs> I took up that whole page. Because I kind of got lazy. Oh, oh. oh what the? Oh, it's like a clown. And then, oh, wait. I actually never finished the last two parts. But this was the end. It was like 6 a.m. Yes. And then it was like, I think I was going to show two more parts. And that was it. Unless if that was the end. I just didn't know what else to put. So I just left it blank. But yeah. Oh, but this one. I did completely finish and staple. FNAF 1. Now, uh, he also made me work on this one, but he also made his own separate one, but he never finished it. Because he decided he was just going to help me with mine instead. That's my design of Foxy. So, yeah, pretty cool. 
<laughs> Bro. Oh. Man. Those good old days, bro. <laughs> bro, wow. It's crazy looking back at this. Oh my. Bro, those are some weird endoskeletons I did. <clears throat> no, wow, this is actually the longest one, I think. Out of the FNAF comics I did. I want to do FNAF 4 someday, but according to my luck, it's probably never going to happen. It's just not the same without Christian anymore. He was my man. I'll miss him. Oh. And Foxy's smoking a cigar. Oh, I remember I based it off of like a story I saw. Uh, whatever. Oh. Oh, I think this part was based on my pivations when Foxy. But well, why does he look like that? I don't know. It looks kind of like burnt. Kind of like what, Phantom Foxy. Oh, Bonnie's going to rock him solo. Shredding. Shredder. Bro, what? Oh! Bonnie! Why would you do? Oh, wow. I, I completely forgot about that part. And then this is like, that too, the sequel design changed. I don't know if I even showed Withered Bonnie in the actual video, especially with her Golden Freddy. So, oh, damn, Chica had a big head. Interesting. Nice design, though. I like that. Um, I guess if I do a part two, I'll show the others. So this one's basically just FNAF only. And then the rest are going to be like non-FNAF. FNAF 1. This is Christian's design. You can see put way more effort in it. But that's why it took him way longer. Dang, bro. He was so much better at it. He put way more time in it. That's why um, it took forever to make. And so we decided we were just going to work on ours together. So they'd be quicker and we could make sure designs. And that's Puppet, even though it's a FNAF one, but I don't know if he knew that much. So. And these are my comics I made on, like, first grade, I remember. I keep forgetting her name, but I remember who I had, and I know I had it for first grade, and I made these. Yeah, the words, oh, like, very bad. So, I'm not gonna show the words, because, like, you can barely even read them. It's, like, really weird. <laughs> the design, bro. Oh, that's Foxy's curtain. Dang, bro. These are like old paper. Oh. Damn. Uh, hold on. Um, uh, someone's calling me, but here are some more comics. 4 a.m. And then boom, there's that. That, I don't, I think that was FNAF. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, at the night guard room, it was. Very questionable. It's like a. I just really want Springtrap in this as like a zombie. You know, what's a bad idea for his. Uh oh. I. Uh oh. Oh! Oh wait, these aren't stapled. I just placed them in there. That. This one is stapled though. I see the staplers. Uh. Yeah, the design wasn't that great. Um, there's... What? Hold on, what the frick? Oh, I don't... A pig... Oh, oh, piggy and elephant. I don't remember their actual name, but it was like a story. Oh, that, this is from FNAF 4. And then for some reason, I put Springtrap on the back. Peace Gold Plat. I don't even know what where I got that from. Uh oh, little designs I made. Little design characters. Oh. 
Yeah, those ones were kind of crappy. I definitely improved a lot. Um, I'm actually curious to see what's in here. I see Spider-Man on the cover, because, I mean, hey, that was my Spider-Man design, so I know. But, man, I gotta see these, bro. Spider-Man 4? That, that's not even real, but, okay. I don't know who that is. Can't remember the guy from Doris. Seek. Oh, I think it was, like, Slenderman or something. I don't know. Yeah, this is a mess. Uh, I need to just, like, redesign some things. Kind of bad, honestly. But I don't know. Um, you know, I'm just gonna do, like, one whole video of this, so. I guess we'll look into the non fanaf the cart. Oh, this was actually a really good one. Uh, weird day. Oh, boy. I put a lot of effort. Whoa, it's dull. I put a lot of effort in this one. Oh my god, bro. Wow. This is crazy. A Spider Man? So, about the background, my family just got home, so they're talking loud. Oh! My friends! You guys, I, I'm still friends with Jamie. This is I met him in like third grade. And they added Jamie here. Weirdo. Adrian. Uh. Oh, yeah. Adrian was the one that came up with the flame dude. That was the one that came up with the design. Christian. This is Christian. And then th That's me. But when I taped oh, I stapled it, whatever. Oh, yeah. I was like the boss. I would basically see how it would go. Like, with, like, um the design. Uh, Christian, he would help me with it. Adrian was, had the ideas. And Jamie was the weirdo. Oh, yeah. This is us. I think it's supposed to be, like, us, like, you know, coming up with the design. Hold on. I gotta read this part. Aren't you the maker of funny... Oh, it was called Funny Lies. Yeah. John Luca, the maker. Can you make the inter... Interior... What? Oh, can you make the entire gang? Okay. Huh. Oh, oh, Batman. Yeah, Batman could not fly. So, that was kind of... Oh, I think that was Christian's design. Because there's no way... Oh, that was definitely Christian's design. Yeah. Christian drew those two. I remember that. That was for sure. He also drew that. That I drew that though. You could tell the difference. <clears throat> I can't. Oh yeah, he drew this page. I remember because you can tell from how much more effort he put. I drew more, but he put more effort into them. Kabu, can boom. The end. Okay. Um, this was one he did all by himself. <laughs> Damn, bro. He, he colored it. Oh, yeah. Christian Adrian. Christian Adrian. Wait, that's someone's Adrian? Or is this Christian and Adrian? I don't even know, bro. I had a friend named Adrian, and that was the one that I came up with the idea, so. But I don't know. Because Christian made this one all by himself, so I don't know why I said Christian Adrian. Maybe that's his last name. Coincidence? Maybe. Oh, yeah. Um, ours was kind of similar with the battle. He wanted to, uh, like, because he wanted ours to be a mix of the same thing, but, like, a different time period. So, it's like, you're seeing different perspectives. And, of course, there's a design choice. <laughs> yeah, he wanted the penguin. I don't know why. I It sucks, because I had also a bunch of other comics that we made. But those were with Christian's binder. And so, he has those left over. And, uh. I have these left over. So. Cool. Man, I just want to talk to him again. He's like such a good friend, but... Hey, who knows? Oh, this was when he was making the FNAF one. Coming soon. FNAF one from Funny Lives. Yep. Ah, uh, good days. Uh, the... The day... Oh, I thought that said the... The day. Huh. Okay. Oh, yeah, I never finished. Oh, actually, this was a short. I don't know why it made some sun, dude. I think this was going to be, like, another character we made. But it just... This might be the only video he was in. He was going to be, like, maybe, like, Flame Sidekick. But... Yeah. Oh, uh, this is one I, I never finished because I kind of just got lazy with it. That... Oh, my... Oh, God. That... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Bro, Captain America, man? Vision? 
Hulk? I don't know why Vision was there, but like, I mean, I couldn't think of anybody else. Uh, Spider Man was there for some reason. Uh, there's Iron Man. Actually, the Iron Man? That, I didn't do that Iron Man. That design was actually pretty good. Uh. Oh, yeah, this is when Ultron attacks. Oh, yep. I kind of bitches off him when he's fighting Thanos. He takes out that big shield and Thanos blasts him, but instead I use Ultron. Uh, huh? Beep, kaboo. Yeah. Oh, uh, I, I drew this because I, I had a Lego call. I still do. And I have a blank papers left, which I had an extra. We could always finish the comic. I mean, hey, I could do it. I have extra paper. And if I run out, and I guess I have to use Sacrifice You. Sorry. Uh, but yeah, that that's all the ones I have left. I had a bunch more. I'll tell you from what I remember. It was like one of them was a vacation that Flame Dude was on. And he was going to find out who created him. And they become sidekicks. And it also explains how he um, lost his leg in that explosion. But Christian kept those. And there was also a plan for the zombies one. But I think Christian also got the, the better ones besides the FNAF ones. Because he kept a lot of the good ones that we worked really hard on, but we never got to finish them because I remember we were working on them just before COVID, and there was even a New Year's Eve one I remember we did, but like the moment, like we were finishing this all up before a break because we wanted to get as much as we could done, and then break came and we thought we were going to see each other right after, but hey, never happened. But yeah, that's my story.